Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another What's New Wednesday. So today I thought I'd do a little bit of a try on for you and share with you some, not all, <laughs> some of my favourite dresses that I've been loving this year. Uh, this is my seasonal clothes rail, so I have my wardrobes and then this is like the overflow, but this is also like I say, the seasonal rail. So this is what I'll gravitate to on a daily basis for work, for weekends. And um, yeah, I pop them on there so I can see them all. And then I usually tend to like plan my outfits for the week on a Sunday. I've been doing that lately and it's working really well. So um, yeah, I just thought I'd take you through some of my favourites. Uh, some are new dresses, some are old. I mean, I haven't just been wearing dresses, although I do tend to wear them a lot um i do wear culottes i've got smock dresses that i tend to wear with leggings as well i wear a lot of kimonos with culottes with dresses but today i thought we'd just we'd just focus on the dresses like i say some are new so you can still be able to get them and i'll leave the links below and um some are old that i still love and um yeah so let's get started so how i thought we'd do this video is i'm gonna take the item of clothing talk about it and then side by side I'll do one of the you know posy <laughs> the posy shots so you can see what it looks like full length um but yeah I'll talk about you know the sizing where it's from that kind of thing so without further ado where should we start I think we're going to start with an oldie an oldie but a goodie um I noticed actually some of the thread is coming away from this dress but I'm not going to chuck it out because I love this dress. So this is from uh, H&M. It's a large, so it's size large. It's a midi dress, leopard print. It's shirred on the bust. And then as you can see, some of the thread, can you see there? Hang on a minute. Oh, some of the thread is coming away. I'm gonna have to sort that out. It is long sleeve, um, but you can wear this on the shoulders or off the shoulders. This tends to be, an all-rounder for me I have worn this to work with um, a waistcoat which I'll show you in a minute um, I've worn it with a white cardigan I've worn this out to dinner with a nice handbag and some sandals um, it's so diverse I don't think leopard print will ever go out of fashion you know what they say don't they leopard is the new black well that's what they have said isn't it but I, I love me a bit of animal print um, but yeah I love this dress it's old from H&M, probably two or three years, but you will be able to find an animal print dress anywhere. I don't think I'll ever stop wearing this until, you know, it's got holes in. <laughs> okay, next up. In fact, the next four dresses, because I've noticed they're all in a row, <laughs> the next four dresses are from Nobody's Child. I seem to have a little bit of an obsession with Nobody's Child dresses. I think I love the cut of them, the style. Um, I found a dress that I think is really flattering on me. Um, three of these are the same style and then one of them is different, but you'll see that in a second. But this one, this, I call this my dopamine dress because it's so vibrant, you can't help but smile when you see it. The colors are so vivid. It's like I'm wearing a giant highlighter pen um, slash fruit salad. <laughs> I just love it. Uh, the only downside to this, it creases like a mofo. It's, <laughs> I believe it or not, I've steamed all these dresses and already it's creased. So that is a downside to this particular one. Uh, this is uh, like a cotton, it's, it's thinner than the other dresses. Uh, this is a size 22. Uh, it's got buttons uh, down, all the way down. We've got a, a band in the middle, which I think is, it's nice because it just cinches you in a bit. It's A-line. It's got pockets, which is incredible. All of the Nobody's Child dresses that I have have pockets, which is, you know, plus. And I love the sleeves. They're so poofy. <laughs> They're really poofy. And um, yeah, I love it. I love this dress. I just wish that it didn't crease as much as it does, but I'm still going to wear it anyway. So you have seen me wear this dress so many times in vlogs now um yeah i think this has to be my favorite dress of the summer so far <laughs> um there's still time there still could be another dress out there that i 
adore as much as this but this one has just not been off my back um again we've got the poofy sleeves buttons all the way down same kind of style with the banding a line pockets uh v-neck actually what i will say with the nobody's child dresses that are this style the v-neck comes down quite low so i do wear a cami with it um yeah it could do with being a little bit higher i think but that's just down to personal preference but i mean i just i love the print on this all of the wild flowers in like the check diamond diamond print it's just it's so beautiful i love the color i think that the color suits my coloring really well as well with that blonde hair and stuff and yeah i just i haven't stopped wearing it it's just one of my absolute favorites and uh, again this is a size 22 all of the nobody's child dresses are a size 22 and i just i love it are we bored of the nobody's child dresses yet no no we're not bored of them because they do prints like this look how pretty this is do you know what i would have looked at a print like this years ago and been like oh no that's so old just like granny fabric but how times change how your style changes i just look at this now and i'm like i love it i want to be in an english country garden with a basket picking me fruit um and then put a penny on and bake a cake this is this is what this dress makes me feel like it's just stunning the print uh, again same style as before uh, the fabric actually the fabric i didn't mention on the green one and this one it's the same it's more of a linen blend um it's like it's quite heavy it creases as well because because linen does crease but because it's quite weighty it's the creases drop out quite easily um but yeah it's comfortable to wear it's flat i feel they're really flattering you can just swoosh about in them pockets poofy sleeves button down v-neck it's a winner okay last nobody's child dress and i actually lied to you because this is a size 18 yeah this is a size 18 and i'm not i'm not an 18 i'm a 22 top 24 bottom usually but with these types of dresses because they're a line i can get away with a 22 and it fit uh, and with this one i think the style of it because it's more smocky um yeah downsized a few sizes and it fits so yeah just to for size for sizing reference if you like this go down a few sizes because it's it's generous but um yeah here is the last nobody's child dress it's a shirt busted one purple and white checked but it's like raised i don't know if you can see it's like a raised fabric uh the sleeves are all stretchy i do love the color of this um because i don't really own a lot of purple things i've got uh, a purple dress with black polka dots but i don't really have anything like lilac -y, um in this style and so i saw this and i was instantly gravitated to it and um i really really like this i tend to wear this with my hair curly rather than straight i know that sounds bizarre does anybody have certain outfits that they know that they'll do their hair a different way or is that just me being weird but anyway i tend to wear this with curly hair like gripped up and then this uh did i did i mention it's got pockets i mean okay next up is a dress from shein that just screams take me on a grecian holiday um maybe it's to do with the colors the blue and the white but i love the print on this it is a smock dress um it's a size 3xl from the curve section now th this is quite oversized and so when i show you side by side if i do like a, a side shot you'll see it is quite big but I like the style of it. I mean, you could always belt it if you wanted to, um, but I just like it as it is, oversized. Um, yeah, it's got a V-neck. Can you tell I like a V-neck? It's got cute little bell sleeves. The fabric is polyester, 100% polyester. I haven't said those words for a while, have I? It's 100% polyester. Um, but it is one of those dresses that has that, you know, that sound to it and um sometimes it can make you sweat a little bit more 
you know what I mean um, but it doesn't detract from you know the print and the style of it which I just like they do this in different colors as well but I just I loved the blue I love the blue and white and um, yeah this I've been wearing this with a wicker bag and my sandals and it's just been lovely we're down to the last few dresses now and um, the next one well the next two are from TU clothing two clothing what do we call them two TU Sainsbury's <laughs> so TU clothing that's what I'm gonna call them Sainsbury's their dresses this year have been amazing amazing I've seen so many lovely ones on Poppy Adams especially if you don't follow Poppy follow her Instagram she's also got TikTok as well but she does a lot of fashion try-ons and yeah this is the inspiration this these dresses these next few dresses I bought them because of her because I was heavily influenced but um yeah just look at the print for a start I love a bold print in a dress it's got a v-neck it's stretchy in the middle um it's got poofy sleeves are we seeing a little trend here uh, this isn't as long as the nobody's child dresses this is more of a midi dress but it's cute it's so nice I've worn this to the beach already and I had two people ask me where it was from I was in a cafe getting a coffee and some woman came in and said I love your dress where did you get it from and then you do the it's from Sainsbury's when I say that it reminds me of Emma Brummy Mummy of Two because she does that doesn't she over on her is it on her Instagram she'll do like a reel or or if she's wearing something and someone asks her she's always like it's from Primark or it's from Sainsbury's and I actually think she has this exact same dress or is it another print or maybe she's got both but I know she belts her dresses so if belt belting your dresses is your thing then it works with these I just wear them as is like with the stretchy stretchy band um but yeah love it I think this was I think this was 25 quid as well um it's a size 20 as well for reference uh, and it's like a linen-y a linen fabric as well um but it's breathable like I said I've worn it to the beach and it was very hot but it was fine so um yeah now this next dress is also from Sainsbury's I haven't worn it yet though um I might wear it this weekend but I have every intention of wearing it with this waistcoat so when I said we'll talk about the waistcoat this I love this denim waistcoat it's from Simply B and I think it just breaks up a dress so nice I've worn this to work so many times with my dresses and each time they're like that looks really nice so it's like a, a summer gilet if you like um but anyway that's the that's the waistcoat let me just talk about the dress i actually got this dress from the maternity section because the main section had sold out and i adored it so much because of the print look at this look at it <laughs> And I, I, it looks so good on Poppy. And I was like, I, I need this dress in my collection. And um, yeah, they'd sold out completely. So I went to the maternity section. Don't be afraid of the maternity section. Just because you're bigger, I still I still wear maternity clothes. And I'm not, not pregnant. I mean, some people might think that's strange. But I don't. At the end of the day, it's fabric. It might be cut a little bit differently. But just try it. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, you can send it back. Um, but this works. I love the sweetheart neck on this, on the bust. I think it's so flattering. I got this in an 18, because it's maternity, so I figured it might be a little bit more giving, and it is, it's fine. Look at the sleeves. How <laughs> amazing are these? It's got a shirred back for extra stretch if you need it um and it's it's a maxi length and it's just I can't wait to wear this I can't believe I haven't worn it yet but like I say I'm gonna wear it with this waistcoat and it's gonna look fabulous okay we are nearly at the end and the last dress that I want to talk about is the one that I'm wearing right now um with a kimono I love this dress this dress is from old navy i got it from old navy in times square 
it was in the sale it was seven pound ninety oh no seven dollars ninety seven and honestly I've worn it so much I'm so glad that I bought it it's v-neck it's got short sleeves but they poof out like this so you can wear it obviously as is but I have been wearing this dress with kimonos it just works I have worn a variety of kimonos with this dress so it's one of those that you can style up in so many different ways so I got this in a size XL what I love about this dress is that it cinches me in at the waist so it kind of gives me a, a almost like an hourglass figure um, but not too like figure hugging it like skims the fabric is it's like a it is like a linen-y cotton blend it's not heavy this is a size XL and I just love how versatile it is like I say I've worn different variations of kimono with this to work and every time I, I'll always get a comment like oh, you look nice today because you know you can just dress it up can't you <laughs> and um yeah love I'm so glad that I bought this <laughs> honestly I wear this dress probably once a week maybe twice a week if it's been in the wash and rotated so yeah it washes well I'll give it that because I've worn it a lot but anyway that is it they are the dresses that I wanted to share with you guys this time around obviously I have you know a whole rack <laughs> Of other clothing but I just wanted to share those with you because they're the ones that you know I've purchased recently I wanted to show you outfits on a a, a larger figure um, don't be scared of color uh, being bold trying out different styles and just seeing what works for you I, I used to be so scared of things and now I just try it if it doesn't work it doesn't work if it does great so yeah I hope this video has been helpful to you um, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Take care and I'll see you guys in the next one.